Welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create a transition that will take your videos to the next level. This video is sponsored by iMyPhone and a small video compressor. Before the CapCut tutorial, I will show you a quick tutorial on how to compress your videos for space saving on your devices, for free uploading and easy sharing. The link is in the video description. Open any small and then choose the compression mode according to your needs. Any small has three compression modes for space saving, free uploading and easy sharing. The first mode is perfect if you want your videos to have the same quality and take up less space on your device. Choose the file size that suits you best. This is what a preview looks like. When you choose the file size, press start and the software will compress your video. The second compression mode is for free upload. It is great for easier uploading videos on social media and email. Select the file size you want and then tap start to compress your video. The third mode is for easy sharing. This mod is my favorite because it helps me quickly transfer my videos from one device to another. Any small is available for Windows and Android. You can find very affordable subscription plans on their website. If you want to try any small, you can download it for free. The link is in the video description. Open CapCut, tap on the new project and select two videos. This is what my videos look like before editing. Tap on the second video and then select the overlay option. After that, freeze the first frame of the video and then place it in the same way as I did. Tap on the freeze frame and then in cutout remove the background. Now move the freeze frame to the left. Add a keyframe and then after a few frames return the video to its original position. Now select the slide left animation. For now your video should look like this. Export the video and then tap new project and select the exported video. Split the part of the video where the transition is and then select the motion tool option. Adjust as you like and then save the change. Now you can add a sound effect for the transition, I downloaded mine from Epidemic Sound.
explore the video and thanks for watching.